Hi viewers, welcome to Safi Max. In this video, I will let you know how to convert your figures into EPS format for writing theses, books, or publishing papers in research journals. It is always suggestive to use EPS figures in a document. Your your figure may be a picture saved in JPG format or it may be a two or three dimensional figure of certain research data drawn through some scientific software and saved in PDF or PNG format. It is always a wise tip to convert your figure into EPS format because EPS format offers a lot of flexibilities for editing it within a document in any compiler used for composing your document. In this video, I will introduce you to three different softwares you can use for converting your figures from PDF, PNG or JPG format into EPS format. However, presently I will focus only on converting JPG into EPS. The rest of the format can be converted into EPS in a similar way. One method of converting JPG into EPS is to use a browser-based software which is available online. However, for such software you need a strong internet and you don't need to install anything on your computer. You will find many such converters by Google searching. However, for online conversion, I would recommend Conversio. And the second method based on using an installed software on your computer. To learn this, I would begin from GIMP or GIMP software, which is freely available for Windows and Mac. So let's move how can we convert a JPG picture into APS. So here I have a picture which is in JPG format. You can check that from the properties of the figure. It is in JPG format and I want to convert this figure through GIMP into EPS. So this is very simple. Just open up GIMPs. In this window, you need to go to File, Open New, which you can do through Control N as well. And it is asking me for the image size. So I leave it on the default by clicking it on OK. And this is the window in which I will uh, import my figure from the file menu. Open or Control O. It will take you to the directory where your figure is. And in my JPG to EPS. And this is my figure. I want to open this up. So it is showing that the preview is shown over here. This is the figure. I want to save this in EPS format. And you can see from here the, the original figure is in JPG format. So what I do. I just come to the file menu and come to export as. From here, I have to change this pig one to EPS, right? And then I just click the export button at this position. If I export it, a new window opens, which asks me for the size. So uh, the default is a millimeter. You. Uh, for better view, I would like to convert this to inches and for research publications, this size is recommended to be 3 by 3 inches. So the height should be 3 inches and the width should be 3 inch. I put 3 by 3 of the figure and now I want to export it. So my figure is saved. Let me go back to the directory where I have saved. This is JPG EPS format. And if I open this up, you will see now it is saved into EPS format. So this is the EPS format. Now let us convert this through another software, InkSpace. That is also a freely available software you can install on your computer without paying a single penny. Search. I N K. So you see over here, this is in Inkscape, and I enter it to it open it. This is Inkscape, and from here I want to import the figure. So I click on import, 
and this is the figure I want to import this figure over here so the figure is imported and this is obviously very large so I have to reduce the dimension to the page view this is the dimension and now let me increase this again so and now come to the file menu and save a copy as instead of saving as come to save a copy and from here you have to change the name so I would like to give pick one I and K and from here change the format and I have to select the EPS format then I want to replace this one then this window opens up and you don't need to touch anything leave everything as it is just click on OK yes replace so if I go back to the directory and I open this up I have the figure over here so this is the EPS format that you have created from Xpress now if you have a PDF editor installed on your computer the easiest way to convert the JPG into APS is to open the file up with PDF writer and this I do just by clicking on the figure because I have PDF writer installed on my computer and I click on this convert to Adobe PDF if I open this up this file opens up right and uh, I want to convert this first in order to resize it to 3x3 three three, I want to convert this first into letter and then sorry I want to convert this first into 3x3 three three size which is this one if I click the OK so we see here now the picture is saved into 3x3 three three size if I print it it will ask me where to save the file so I go here and uh, go back to the same directory where my files are and first I save this as to EPS so the picture is saved in PDF I have to open it up it is 3 by 3 now and uh, then come to file save as other more option and then click on EPS so I would like to save this with the same as pick to EPS if I save this up the figure is now saved and let's check this out pick to EPS so this is the EPS format you see it is saved over here so you can convert any format PDF PNG and JPG by using any of these three softwares to EPS format.